You're listening to Mostly Motorsports with Scott Trailer. Man, you picked up your second World of Outlaw Big Gator Championship. How'd that feel? Felt really good. You know, uh, it was a bummer. We lost two races uh, due to weather, but, um, you know, we had three different racetracks there uh, for Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and was able to be in contention each night. So it felt really good to uh, just kind of pick up where we left off last year. Yeah, it, it, the track conditions on night number one were a little rugged and a little rough, but uh, it seems like they, they got it worked out. They kind of scraped off maybe some of that new dirt they laid down. Uh, they made a huge improvement over during the week, didn't they? Yeah, you know, the second day they uh, definitely made a massive improvement over night one and then night two, or night three, I'm sorry, was kind of a nightmare because of the canceled races from the modifieds and they raced all day long. And the rubber was already down before we even did hot laps. So qualifying and hot laps were rubber down and we blew, we wore the tires right off the thing in two laps and um, they were able to rework it uh, before the heat races and then and ended up being a pretty good um, A main racetrack. So they definitely made improvements. And I think, you know, uh, the, the non wing cars and the late models should have some good services moving forward. All right. We had your car owner, Todd Quaring, on here um, about a week or so ago. Man, it, it seems like that you're in a great situation with Todd. Uh, the resources are there. We know what he, what he can do with those resources. And it, it seems like to me that if there was ever a time that you could make a run at this championship, it would be this year. Yeah. You know, um, I've been able to put some good seasons together with the world of outlaws, but, uh, after last year, you know, being under a hundred points away from the points championship was definitely something very uh positive and shows you that we're you know we're pretty close to getting the job done so we're hoping for a year or two we can make uh some improvements and um you know.